Assalamu alaikum dear students. Today we are going to solve the exercise of the lesson interjection. Interjection is a part of a speech. The word interjection means thrown in. An interjection is a word thrown in mostly at the beginning of a sentence or in a conversation to express some sudden feeling. It is followed by an exclamation mark. Interjections have no grammatical value, but we use them quite often. Exercise Read the sentences and close the words that show surprise, relief, sadness, joy, or disgust. Wow! What a brilliant idea! We will enclose the word wow. <sighs> what did you say? We will enclose the word <sighs> Oops! I am sorry. We will enclose the word oops. Hi, how are you? We will enclose hi. Ah, I have got a toothache. We will enclose ah here. Ouch, that hurts. We will enclose ouch. <sighs> it's finally done. We will enclose yeah, this tastes awful. We will enclose. Yeah. Hooray. We won. We will enclose the word hooray here. The next exercise is which word will you use to express the following expression and feelings? Choose the words from the box. Number one, hello, bravo, shh, oh, boo, oops, to greet, hello, to appreciate, bravo, to scare, boo, to indicate sorrow, Oh, to express a mistake, oops, to indicate, to be quiet, shh, we will move to our next exercise, the interjections in Nikki and Ricky's conversation are mixed up, rewrite the sentences using the correct interjection. Ugh, the milkshake is delicious. Mmm, the milkshake is delicious. In place of ugh, we will write mmm. Mmm sh shows containment of something. Hey, it's all over your face. Gosh, it's all over your face. Gosh expresses surprise or in place of oh my god we use gosh gosh can I have one more hey can I have one more in place of gosh we use hey hey is used to get attention mm. You have already had four. Ugh, you have already had four. In place of mm, we will use ugh. Ugh is an interjection that shows annoyance. Wow, who, oops, hi, ah, uh, ouch. Yeah. Hello.
Bravo. Exercise in your notebook. Allah Hafiz.